Hey everybody, Sillycat2 here. Welcome back for more Golden Sun The Lost Age. In the last episode, we made it all the way to Madra. And in this episode, we are going to be taking a look around. So, with that being said, let's get started. First place we want to go is actually outside town. As you can see here, there's some graves here. Apparently the town elder is missing. He's out on a trip or something. That's interesting. Anyway, what we want to do is go through the same hole the pirates used to get in. This is the Madra Catacombs. There are a couple new enemies here. I'll be going over them as we encounter them. Ah! Right on cue. This is the Drone Bee. He has 63 HP, he's very agile, and he's weak to Jupiter and strong to Venus. His attacks include Numbing Sting, which is a single targeting Jupiter elemental attack that has a small chance of stunning whoever it hits. He has a 1 in 16 chance of dropping an elixir. I can't believe that Champa just wandered into his cave by accident. That's like winning the lottery or something. I totally missed what he said there. Anyway, we can use Lash on this rope here. And cross over to the other, to the other side. Mini goblins, we've seen these guys already. Here's the main part of the uh, dungeon, but we can't do anything about it yet because there's a certain synergy we need that we just don't have. <clears throat> you really all the gem there. Oop, and the rope seems to have just kind of vanished on us. Uh, let's go around, go around, and try that again. There's something there that we want. By the way, this cave theme is awesome. <laughs> and that goes without saying, all the Golden Sun music is awesome. Yeah, let's go in here and... This is really going to be the only new enemy we find in this place. be nice if you guys didn't take up my recording time here. And we have so much space for storing videos. Anyway, uh, we are now in the sort of the back side of the city. There's a couple things we can do here. Ah, new enemies, troll. These have 101 HP, and they have the sort of unique property of recovering 10 HP per turn. This is the first you're going to be seeing of enemies that recover HP over time. They're weak to Mars and strong to Jupiter, so let's take them out with Jenna. Their special attack, Brute Force, does heavy damage to one target, it's Venus Elemental, and it has a 1 in 32 chance of dropping a nut. As you can see, uh, they're not really any match for Jenna. Whoops! No! I do not want to use Retreat! It's my first menu fail of the episode. Not my first of the series, though. That made a lot more of a series, I think.
Anyway, going down here, you can get the Tremor bit. Tremor is an earth elemental synergy that shakes things back and forth. <clears throat> it has no effect in battle because you can't use it in battle. That's really all that we came here for. Kind of one of those weird things you really need a guide for, but... Hey, this is a let's play. <laughs> this is the guide. <clears throat> Alright, now well, we've done that. Uh, let's take a look around town. It's like all three continents got together to form a super continent. That big wave moved the whole continent of Indra to the south. Now we're sandwiched between the two continents of Gondolin and Osenia. If I could walk to Osenia, I'd like to see Erd's Rock out near Garrow. A boat that ran aground in the Cove Alley looks like a normal ship almost, but I'm not sure a boat like that can even sail. They say that boat belongs to the Champa, but I keep telling them that boat looks like no Champa ship I've ever seen. Yeah, we actually noticed that it looks more like Satros's ship. Did you come here with a Deccan Plateau? Yeah, you must have seen that boat ran near the cave, right? I hear it was a Champa boat, and on it they found an unconscious Champa. So they didn't add them, of course, and they tossed them in our jail. Really? Well, there's some interesting evidence, if anything. Lands to the south of Gondolin are full of barbarians, I'm told. Yep. <laughs> Indra is in direct contact with southern Gondolin. Will we be safe? Yeah. <clears throat> Let me guess, you want a boat, right? Look, I told that last guy to tidal wave went and ruin all our boats. So, Alex was here too. Hmm. Legendary Beast of the Deep. Interesting. Like we thought, he's not home. He went to deal with Briggs. Keeps saying that he's not Champa. So, the other thinks that this guy that they threw in jail isn't with the pirates. Hmm. Admit it, you're one of the Champa, aren't you, Piers? Speak, or let your science, silence condemn you. Uh, whatever happened to innocent until proven guilty? I told you already, I'm not a Champa. Then where'd you come from? In the heart of the Eastern Sea. If I told you where, you'd never believe me. Look at me when I'm talking to you! Are you trying to mock me? I implore you, do not anger me. Oh, do you? So what's gonna happen if I make you angry? Hey, Shin, maybe you should go easy on him. Hey, it wasn't your girlfriend who got hurt. I'm sorry she was injured, but I cannot... I don't want your sympathy for you. I want you to get angry for me. Stop, please. Even my patience has its limits. Hey, don't you want to see what it'll do? I think we should just stop. My words will not cool your temper, then... Wow, well, what do you know? He's a Mercury addict. Oh, that was Synergy! <laughs> the guy just falls on his face. Did you do that? What did your friend expect? You monster! I am no monster. Help! This man, he must be an adept. Nope, Chuck Tesla. You're right, we only did. He actually believes it! <laughs> <laughs> Great in you, idiot. Of course he's an adept. I'm just messing with you. 
Yeah, when will that kindly elder return and end my imprisonment? I have no time to wait, but I don't want to have to hurt anyone. Let's start reading his mind. Why did I use my synergy in anger? I must maintain control. My actions should never cause regret. Since someone using synergy... That person, could it be... No, it's not of my people. When will I be freed? Hmm. Has Piers escaped? Oh, I'm so relieved. So Piers hasn't escaped? If he had escaped, the other would no longer be able to protect him. But from the look of things, it seems there was a scuffle. The cell is in disarray. What happened in there, I wonder? Seems Piers is a man of many mysteries. Not the least of which being that boat he arrived in. So that's his boat! Oh, you there. You look like travelers. My lady, now is not the time to be speaking with strangers. It's alright. This one has such kind eyes. Yaw. When did you arrive, and where are you going? My lady, please. Are you going to Osenia? I guess we are, yeah. I knew it. One requires permission to cross the bridge to Osenia, correct? Then I hereby grant my permission to these four travelers. Relay that message at once. You may all continue your journey and cross into Osenia. If we try to tell someone what we saw, who would believe us? I think I'll just garden from out here where it's safe. <clears throat> hmm. Interesting stuff. Oh, hey, can we, like, jump over there? I guess we can't jump over there. Alright, let me think. I actually think there's something we can, uh, do if we go this way first. Might be wrong, though. Oops. No, I do not want to fight a troll. This guy has some pretty high defense for, uh, well, I don't know. Now my physical attacks are just kind of uh, lacking in the attack department. This is where we want it. New enemy, Willhead! They are weak to Venus, strong to Mercury. They are returning enemies from the first Golden Sun. Their special attack, Mystic Flames, is a single targeting Mars elemental attack. It's pretty weak, I wouldn't worry too much about it. They have a 1 in 32 chance of dropping a smoke bomb. Should just kind of deal with them. Wait a second, I didn't write down the uh, how much HP they had. Uh, I guess I'll put that up in the bio. <laughs> and hopefully I won't mess up the bio like I always do. Anyway, over here we actually have some clips between Gondawin and Indra. But at the moment, it turns out we actually can't really do anything. Our target is that mushroom up there, but we need a certain synergy to be able to get up there. That Kate, we need a frost. So yeah, we won't be going there until later. That was actually a pretty good place to end off the episode. Uh, we didn't get very much done except for getting that a uh, tremor bit, but we found out about peers and new enemy. Awesome! This is the rat. He has 49 HP. He has very high defense for the place he's found in. He's weak to Mars though, so you just want to have Jenna attack, and it should take him out pretty quickly. Yeah, see, one hit KO with beam. Anyway. 
with that said and done, it's about time I ended off this episode. So, if you like this part, subscribe to my videos, big yellow button up top, give me a thumbs up down below this video, and be sure to check out my other stuff. This is Silcat 2. I will be seeing you later. I want to save this! Menu fail!